Mm. Greetings from my closet. Um, I want to introduce y'all to this very simple concept. That if you want it, you got to go get it. Some of y'all got this concept of what you want, what you want to accomplish. You know, some of y'all are motivated by broke. I'm broke, I'm stuck, I'm fucked up, I can't do nothing. Some of y'all are motivated by just wanting to accomplish the things that you want to accomplish. Other folks are motivated by materialistic things. It's a very simple concept. If you want it, you got to go get it. And what does that mean? It means that you trying to convince me or anybody else that you want to get it when you partying all week, as soon as you get any kind of money, you buying a bunch of shit that you really can't afford. What you got the latest iPhone for? Huh? What's the difference in the iPhone 5 and the iPhone 6 other than the fact that it's new? Can you technically afford that? See, everything about what you're doing and the moves that you're making is getting in the way of the big picture. Everything. You still clubbing. You still partying. You still popping bottles with models. You doing the most already. And you ain't even on. You trying to convince everybody around you that you on, but you not on. You know the truth and I know the truth. You ain't on. Most of the people who really ain't got it, they go out of their way to try and show people that they have it. The more you go out of your way to show me that you have it, you're confirming to me that you really don't got it. Because it's perception versus reality. It's perception versus reality. Because you pulling up to the club in the nicest car don't mean you actually got gas money. While everybody else is caught up in, oh shit, look what he pulling up in. I know the truth, homie. I see the look on your face when you order all them bottles in the corner with like 15 to 20 bad ones around you. As soon as that lady walk up to you with the little flashlight, you up in the corner looking miserable as a motherfucker because you ain't got it. It's time to stay focused. It's time to decide, fuck clubs, fuck partying, fuck trying to fit in and socialize, rub elbows with everybody so people can stop calling you weird. Why are you so antisocial? Because I'm trying to get it. Why are you staying on the basketball court so much? Because I'm trying to get it. Why are you out there practicing in the hot sun when ain't nobody else out there? Because I'm trying to get it. Why are you not clubbing? Like every time I text you and invite you to go do something fun and cool, you always studying because I'm trying to get it. Let me tell you something, homie. These women ain't going nowhere. These clubs, these parties, all this shit ain't going nowhere. The more weird you are is a reflection of how committed you are to focusing on your shit, molding and shaping and developing your ideas and your craft so that when it's time for you to make your rounds, you're going to fly. Stop running around here trying to live up to the hype, homie. You on a bus stop with the new iPhone 6. That shit don't make no sense. I'm just keeping it real, man. I'm tired of the games. Y'all out here trying to slip everybody Mickey's, taking pictures on Instagram of your money. You ain't got it. You ain't got it. Stop fronting. And I'm not coming at y'all on any other level but keeping it real. The life that I live, I deserve this life because I work my ass off to get it. Y'all out here running around creating these, this, this smoke on the brink of destruction. And it's all self-inflicted. You did it to yourself. Trying to live up to the hype and create the smoke that you doing it. You ain't doing it. You still got work to do. Stay on that basketball court. Stay on that football field. Fuck all the homies texting and calling and trying to make you feel bad about being so focused. It's grind season, homie. It's not about today. 
It's about the future. You do the work now. Do the work now. And all of the shit that you could ever want to do for your family, your kids, your loved ones, it's all going to be on a whole nother stratosphere. It's time to stay focused, man. I love y'all, man. This is what I hope. I hope this video makes you uncomfortable. Because I look at this, I look at this as a mirror. You get to look yourself in the mirror and ask hard and tough questions. What am I doing every single day with my life, creating obstacles, challenges, and distractions for myself? Creating distractions for myself because of all of this pressure that I live under trying to make all of these people think that I'm doing it big. It's ridiculous, man. It's crazy. What pair of shoes should I put on? Shit. I don't know. I'll think about that later. <laughs> I love y'all. Pull it together, people. It's a whole nother level out here, man. Let me tell y'all something. If somebody were to tell me the shit that I'm telling y'all, my life would have changed forever ago. If I had this information right here, before I got in the game, before I got on, man, it would have saved me millions and millions of dollars. All I was doing when you broke and you fucked up the way I was, as soon as you start making money, everybody makes you feel bad about being so blessed. So then you're trying to pay everybody's bills and save everybody, trying to pull everybody up. Because in your mind, damn, I got more than everybody else. So you're trying to save everybody, pay everybody's bills because you actually feel guilty. Don't feel guilty when you worked your ass off to have the things that you have. But at the same time, don't feel like because you're on and you're making money that you can just kick your feet up and fucking party and wild out all day. It's, it's time to get back in there and stay focused, man. I need you to graduate. You got in college. I need you to finish. I need you to graduate from high school. I need that. I need it badly. Of course it's going to get hard. Of course there's all kind of stuff outside of school that can fuck with your focus. But you got you to gotta stick that shit out, man. Ladies, fellas, come on. It's another level to this shit, man. It's not lonely at the top if you help somebody else get there. I should not care. I should not care. I should just focus on my music and my movies and doing my thing and focus on Tyrese. I should not care about you. I should not. But guess what? I do. I don't want to be the only one out here getting it. I don't want to be the only one out here living this life and lifestyle. Come on, man. Come on. Somebody else join me. Somebody else. I'm, I'm giving you my hand and I'm saying take my hand and let's fly. Do the work, though, man. You got to do the work. I'm on my way to the studio right now. And I'm not leaving the studio till probably about 930 tomorrow morning. So when you see me living the life and lifestyle that I live, don't question my shit, homie. I earn this.